नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम नौशाद अहमद अस्सलाम वालेकुम सर इज यूजिंग क्रेडिट कार्ड हलाल इफ यू आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द कन्वेंशनल क्रेडिट कार्ड वेर वेद द बैंक गिव यू परमिशन दैट यू कैन यूटिलाइज एक्स अमाउंट ऑफ मनी डिपेंडिंग अपॉन द क्रेडिट कार्ड विद दैट इज ब्रॉन्स लेवल सिल्वर लेवल गोल्ड लेवल डिपेंडिंग अपॉन द अमाउंट सम गिव यू फ्यू थाउजेंड डॉलर सम गिव टेन थाउजेंड डॉलर सम गिव फोर्टी थाउजेंड डॉलर डिपेंडिंग अपॉन द लेवल एंड दिस मनी दैट यू यूटिलाइज यू हैव टू गिव विद इन वन और टू मंथ्स एंड इफ यू गिव दैट देन देर इज नो इंटरेस्ट इफ यू गिव अबव दैट देन देर इज एन एक्सॉबरेट इंटरेस्ट विच गोज टू अप टू मे बी थ्री परसेंट अ मंथ दैट इज थर्टी सिक्स परसेंट एनी वे फ्रॉम टू टू थ्री परसेंट अ मंथ दैट इज ट्वेंटी फोर टू थर्टी सिक्स परसेंट अयर विच इज एक्सॉबरेट and i know there are some scholars who say that if you are using a credit card as long as you see to it you pay within the stipulated time within the one month or two month frame and no interest is that's permitted i disagree with it it is totally haram the moment you take a credit card from a conventional bank you are signing a document saying that if you do not pay it in time you will give riba signing a document that you will pay riba is also haram Allah and His Rasul will wage a war against you. So even using a credit card with the intention that you will not take longer than the time permitted, I know majority of the Muslims living in Western countries, in America, in European countries, in UK, have a credit card from a conventional bank. Majority, unfortunately, I know there are scholars of the Western countries that need permission. It is hundred percent totally haram. All the major scholars, whether it be Chakut, I mean. Whether it be Sheikh bin Baz, majority have said even having a credit card of conventional bank is haram because you are signing, and who can give guarantee that you will always pay on time? You are a human being; you can make a mistake. If once also you forget to pay on time, it is haram. Allah and the Rasul wage war against you. Even if you pay on time regularly, only signing a document is haram. So using a credit card. of a conventional bank it's totally haram i am aware there are some scholars that have been permission i disagree with them what you can do is you can have a credit card from islamic bank if it's islamic bank you can have a credit card the other what you can do is have a debit card debit card means the money is already in your account that you are not signing a document saying that you will pay interest so debit card in a conventional bank is permitted credit card in a conventional bank is haram however credit card in the islamic bank is permitted because it works on the islamic principles on the sharia basis there is no riba involved in this so the best option is have a credit card in islamic bank the second option is have a debit card in a conventional bank which does not attract any interest but credit card in a conventional bank is haram it's a major sin it is equivalent to doing zina with your mother that's what a prophet said it is clearly mentioned in mustadak al hakim Hadith number two two five nine that there are seventy three levels of riba. The lowest level is doing zina with your mother, and it's clearly mentioned in the Quran in Surah Baqarah chapter two, verse number two seventy two seventy nine, that if you give up not the demands of riba, take notice of a vow from Allah and His Rasul. So I request all the Muslims in any part of the world, if you have a credit card from any of the conventional bank, please today itself, if not today tomorrow, please discontinue it. open an islamic bank if you don't have islamic bank convert it into a debit card debit card is permissible where there is no riba involved hope that answers the question